Okay. Baby names are often based off of, you know, the latest trends, and they're always changing. Nameberry compared names officially given to babies in the U.S. last year against their list of names, uh, name baby name ideas in their database. It turns out there was, were several names that weren't used at all in 2016. Many of the names are based on literature or nature. The least popular baby names for girls include Bluebell, Perdita, Daffodil, which I love, Hester, and Madrigal. I like Daffodil. Could you imagine? Daffodil flowers? That sounds great, right? There All you right, go. the unused names for boys include Mo, Humphrey, Tib Tibble, how do you say that? Tibble, Tybalt, I have no Gulliver, idea. and Kermit. I can't imagine why you know, these are the least popular I, names. I don't get it, let me just tell you. Um, okay, uh, so speaking of babies, remember back in the day, Natalie came into the office, she told us there was a rumor that George Clooney and his wife were expecting, and she was right. She broke it right I got my finger right on here. the pulse, that's right. Yes, so all the Clooney twins <laughs> are here. An email from George Clooney's publicist reads, the actor and his wife Amal welcomed Ella and Alexander Clooney into their lives on Tuesday, the first children for both. The email also says the twins and mom are healthy and doing fine and jokes that George is sedated and should recover <laughs> in a few days. The publicist did not share where the twins were born. That's awesome. See yeah. that? I know. Just listen to me. I've got my finger on the pulse on my the Hollywood news. Goodness. Mm -hmm. Yes, you do. She has an in. I know, right. Mm -hmm. Okay, so you missed America's Got Talent I last did. night. Yes. Um, it was a talent-packed show, and there was one incredible singer with a powerful story that captured the hearts of everyone, including the judges. Check it out. Yes, I, I lost all my hearing when I was 18 years old. Wow. And how old are you now? Uh, 29. So it's 10 years. Wow. And Mandy, how did you lose your hearing, if you don't mind me asking? I have a connective tissue disorder, so basically I got sick and my nerves deteriorated. So your shoes are off because you're feeling the vibration. Is that how you're following the music? Yeah, I'm feeling the tempo, the, the beat uh, through the floor. And Mandy, what are you going to sing? I'm going to uh, sing a song that I wrote called Try. I don't feel the way I used to. The sky is gray much more than but I know one day I'll get through And I'll take my place again If I would try If I would try Mandy, I don't think you're gonna need a translator for this. Hearing? No. At 18? No. And she was oh, look at pitch her. perfect. Right. Look at what How she's do doing. How do you do that? That's determination right it's there. It's amazing. Yeah. I love that.